Hello, my name is Brian Roth, and I would like to show you through our 42MD Elite. Uh, this is a Lux product that is actually one I'm walking through you through today is open and available for sale. So give us a call. Um, we're going to just walk around the outside, and then we'll do the interiors. This model here is our mid den, so it has an extra little bonus room uh, that we can walk through. This one here set up for a flip up bunk and jackknife sofa below we can do two bunks i can make that a sewing room an office space uh, it is power being the manufacturer we can make that space a little bit more versatile for you so i'll show you that here in a moment but we'll walk around the outside and we'll talk about some of the attributes of what we offer everything we do here at lux is going to be a full body paint so everything we do is going to be multiple layers of paint even logos there's no decals on this coach it will also be double cleared and wet sand and buffed. Everything that we do is fully automotive, painted all the way above the roof line, so you're never gonna have fading or cracking up there because we do an aluminum channel in that transition. Right now we're looking at the moon dust paint job, which is a newer paint job for us. Um, we're going to build with a one-piece seamless fiberglass cap that runs wraps around all of your edges. You're going to have a more ride pin box as a standard on all of our products. You can upgrade to the Gen Y pin on the toy hauler if you choose to do so. We can also do that on this model if you would like. Uh, right now I'm standing in front of one of our Lux trucks with this nice beautiful hitch. This one here is going to uh, handle that and more. This is a wonderful, beautiful truck we've got. Stepping forward into the bay here with the power, I've got our battery disconnect switches at the front, your brake actuator, your batteries, and then your pump for your hydraulic jacks. All of these are going to be color coded and then correspond to the foot itself. Everything's going to uh, go from the pump straight to the jack. You will have the ability to troubleshoot easier with that because you've got it home run all the way back. We'll use an equalizer leveling system for our leveling. You're gonna have nice large 12 inch pads in the front. You'll have four 10 inch pads in the rear. They're gonna have a little bit more substantial arms and legs. Uh, plus they are not a jack that's gonna all be daisy chained together on one side so they'll work independent from each other. Um, that is why we choose to use the equalizer leveling system. We'll have two 40 pound LP tanks, one on either side of the rig with a valve you can switch between or run both. You've got a nice large pass through storage. I can do a more ride tray slide in here if you choose to. Another thing that we'll offer uh, is access to the components below. So in the back of the water box, I've got something built in for you to access. We've also got access to the components below um, if you ever should have to get into there, we would like our units to be serviceable uh, for ease because we want you to get back on the road if need be. As we step forward here, I can tell this one has our Arctic package. You've got two 35,000 BTU furnaces aboard. Another small storage bay for some items. I'll also uh, go ahead and point out while we're here You've got no screws along the sidewall here in the transition between your fiberglass and your fender skirting. All of our fender skirting is going to be a full metal with supports in the back. Everything's covered so you don't have like 500 screws running along the side of the coach. We have an outside radio, 12 volt plug, or sorry, 110 plug. Up top you've got awning lights in your awnings and your marine grade speakers, dual pane frameless windows throughout the unit. This model's coming with a uh, step above entry stair. It's an option for us, pretty popular. That one just folds and stows inside the unit um, and has actual feet that are set to the ground that you can adjust depending on the terrain and what you're experiencing. Have an extended grab handle 
All of our elites are going to come standard with a Moride independent suspension. These are three 8K Moride independent suspension axles, 17 and a half inch H rated Goodyear tires, hydraulic disc brakes. Um, the suspensions are very important to the ride and safety of the vehicle. We spare no expense in that. We're going to give you factory installed a very, very safe running gear. On our slide rooms as we step forward, one unique feature of our slide rooms is the end wall here that you see is still three inches thick, just like the rest of our side walls. So you've got a vacuum bond laminated sidewall, three inches thick on the exterior, two inches thick here. These are all uh, vacuum bond laminated as well. On your seals here, we've got a triple seal sweep. So you've got a bulb seal on the interior that you can see here that comes out with it. So once it's out, it's nice and sealed. And then you've got a bulb seal on the exterior with a seal sweep. Once it's in, then you've got it sealed here nicely. You've got a seal sweep that will flip those forward and back. And then you also have a bulb seal on the exterior of the slide trim fascia. Once this room comes in, it's gonna actually be completely countersunk. It's one unique attribute of the Lux. Once the unit comes in, it sits inside this pan. So it's gonna be completely flush mount, giving us the nice aesthetic. Um, and then once the unit's closed up, it's also not gonna have any UV rays exposed on your seals, which is nice to, if you're storing it somewhere outside, you're not gonna have uh, those being exposed to UV rays. Outside entertainment on this vehicle. You've got an LG 4K smart TVs throughout. Um, and then you've got a DVD player, Bluetooth, extra radio assist speakers in here. We're gonna have another storage area back here for you here. We try and put storage wherever possible. Also a one piece seamless fiberglass cap for the rear roof ladder. <laughs> this uh, model here comes equipped with the power cord reel. That is an option uh, to do. It's a nice option because of the 50 amp cord. It is a little bit cumbersome. Uh, it's a very popular option for us. This is gonna be the back of your fridge access point. So you can always get back here if need be um, to access that. We just try and build that in for you. Literally everything is framed out in these side walls. We'll have a welded aluminum frame. So even vents on the side, windows, doors, every compartment has a framing to it. It's all gonna be wood filled if it is load bearing as well. Everything we do is a welded aluminum framing. Stepping forward here, this is your mid den. So this unit here has four slides aboard. This is that extra bonus room we talked about that we'll see on the inside. And then the other side of your uh, pass-through storage with your water station. All your valves are here. Pretty easy, everything's labeled. Your on-demand hot water heater. And you can see now the access to the back of the water station and how we've actually got the PEX lines insulated in here. Your leveling jacks will run from this box. You'll be able to set your auto level for your truck. So once you get here, we can set your front jacks to be the level of your truck and it has that memory so that you won't have to worry about. You can just set it, pull it up, hook, hit hook up, and then pull the rest of your jacks up. These are automatic leveling. All right, stepping inside here, I've got this door closed. Uh, we had a little bit of sound from our production facility, but once you close the doors in these models because of the three inch thick walls and the addition of the soft touch panel on the Elite, it is so quiet in here. Plus we've got the air conditioner running up front, um, which when we step up there, you'll be able to hear our nice whisper quiet ACs. Your control panel is going to be set up here. Um, we use an in-command system that'll run all of your lighting, slide rooms, generator, 
awnings, and you do also have the ability to do an app on your phone. Uh, you can simply step in here, shut all the lights on and off from one button. In addition, on the Elite product, we have the in-command touch panels throughout the unit. So just right inside this door here, you have your awning, your awning lights, and you'll have the interior lighting functions set here, um, and then multiple panels throughout the unit as well. We have this one equipped with a buffet table because we have the outside entertainment area. You've got some power in there, overheads. We don't want to cut down on your storage as much as we can. You've got the ability to then pull this out to further sit more people. You can easily pull that out to seat four. All of your windows are going to have a MCD roller shade. You'll have a solar shade to help with the sun and then you'll have a complete blackout shade as well. It's just that simple pull. We do have power shades available um, if you should choose to do so. This unit has equipped with our Lambright upgrade theater seating. It's got a pull down for cup holders here, but you can see it makes into a nice love seat. If you should not want to use that, you got a nice drawer for storage here and remotes. Uh, it's a really nice uh, feature that we offer with the Lambright. They use ultra leathers throughout, and we actually use ultra fabrics throughout all of our line. Um, we don't have any laminated vinyls, which you'll have heard have some issues. We're using the ultra fabrics. It's a 100% polyurethane product with extruded polyurethane. So we can always provide you any more information on that if you should uh, need. Overhead storage up above. All your lights within this room are gonna be pretty dimmable. Um, you've got that additional panel here that'll run multiple functions. You've got a USB combo outlet on either side of the sofa. And um, just overhead, some more overhead storage wherever we can put it. You've got all your pre-wire going to be up here for your satellite and co coax cables and everything. Everything's satellite prepped, everything is solar prepped within our units. So we can always add and talk about those features for you if you choose. This little black bubble that you see here is gonna be a temperature sensor. That's gonna allow for us to read the temperature at multiple locations um, throughout the coach so we make sure that your temps stay consistent. In the entertainment area, you've got storage up above, fireplace, 5000 BTU furnace, Blu-ray player, LG sound bar. You've also got a subwoofer built in back there um, for all of your entertainment needs in addition to the hidden storage back behind the television. We're going to use LG appliances throughout so you have an LG fridge, French door freezer bottom, residential, if you guys want to do a gas electric, we can always do that as well. Your island is a nice large island on this. You've got a wireless charger built in to the actual countertop. A lot of people think that's a defect into the countertop, but it's not. It's actually designed uh, for us to be able to have a wireless charger set right here. It's a nice feature that we often forget to mention. <laughs> we take it for granted. All of your drawers are dovetailed. They're all solid hardwood throughout. You've um, got actual wood bottoms, not panel board. As you can see, we've got a nice silverware drawer inset in here and I've even built a little cubby for your sink covers to stow. All of your drawers are going to be soft close as well. More storage here underneath. If you want to do a dishwasher, here's where it would live. We've added this little flip down for sponges and the like. Um, any you know time you want to just stick it in here and stow it away so it's not setting out on the counter. It's just one little unique added feature. All of your plumbing down here, everything's going to have a disc or a shutoff valve at each individual point um, if you should need 
to shut it off for any reason. You've got access right there at every point of the plumbing that's coming in. This has a nice amount of pantry storage in here along with more pull-out drawers. 24 inch residential range. We've also got 30s available if you choose. Convection microwave, again LG. And this one has a nice coffee nook uh, for stowing coffee. I've had people do full pantries here. Um, if you don't want that little nook area but you need more food storage. Got adjustable shelving throughout that. And then we're gonna step into our bonus room. So this one's set up for your grandchildren or whoever may be coming with you. Um, it's got a flip up bunk here. So this can flip up and stow away, lock up top. And then you've got a jackknife sofa down here below that you can use this as a den room. Uh, in case you're wanting to watch different television than the main. You've got your washer dryer in here. Storage up top. And this has the desk built into it. Um, again, I've done sewing rooms, so we can always go bigger with the desk and eliminate some of that storage. If you need more room, bigger office, um, we can always make this a little bit more of a versatile space. Let's head on down the hallway. I'll walk you through the bath. So solid surface throughout, um, you can pick, I've got six countertops to choose from. We've got four different tile choices within. Uh, you've got a medicine cabinet with a decent amount of storage up top here. You've got storage down below. Everything we do is gonna be uh, porcelain toilets. Your one-piece shower has got a seat built into it. It's one-piece fiberglass shower. We've got a couple other shower options as well if you should choose uh, to do that. We can, we can talk about it. You just give us a call. And a linen closet. Fantastic fans in the kitchen and the bathroom are going to be standard. Um, that's got a remote that runs multiple functions. You can set different speeds and temps on that. Everything that we do is going to be complete solid hardcore or solid hardwood, um, no hollow core doors within anything that we build, regardless. Again, soft touch panels on all the walls, standard on the Elite. Stepping into the bedroom area, we talked about earlier how I had the AC running up here. This is your whisper, quiet AC. As you can hear, you can hold a conversation just fine with this. These are all gonna be dual zone ducted. On this model here, you'd have three whisper quiet ACs. King bed with storage. You got a couple chairs stowed and your leaves for your table in there. Storage up above the bed and you've got outlets beside each side. These are going to be combo outlets as well so they'll have USB um, and then your standard plug. Our closets up top are going to be pretty spacious walk-in closets. You'll have dressers built in both sides so you have a his and hers shoe closet in the center. Again, outlets wherever we possibly can for you. And then a nice sturdy closet rack. Lights are all uh, gonna be pretty dimmable in this area as well. So you can kind of change the mood and ambiance. And we'll close those closet doors for you. Everything gonna have pretty substantial latches. So once you're traveling, you can make sure that they're nice and secure and stowed away. And pretty much that's it, but we just got some more storage here in the bedroom area. Again, smart TVs, all LG, 4K smart TVs, um, Blu-ray player. And thank you for coming through uh, with me today on our 42MD. We really appreciate it, and please give us a call.